Thanks for inviting us in at 6 o'clock and we begin tonight with a victim of a road rage attack who told 13 News that another man got out of his car and came at him with an axe. Our Rich Nye now shows us the serious cuts that that victim suffered and the warning he now has for drivers. Chet Montgomery has cuts on his wrist, on his palm, on his thigh, and on his chin. He needed stitches in all those places after being attacked by another driver swinging an axe. The incident happened just before 3 p.m. on March 11th. Montgomery was driving south on Martin Luther King Jr. Street when he says another car pulled into his lane at 21st Street, forcing Montgomery into the median. He says that car then slowed way down in front of him, so he drove around but did not yell or gesture or honk. Montgomery was stopped by a red light at 16th Street. Now I'm thinking the incident is over as far as I'm concerned. But I looked in my rearview mirror and I see this guy's taking something out of his vehicle. You know, so I'm assuming he's going to take whatever it is and smash my win window. Montgomery got out of his car to stop the man, later identified as Jimmy Calhoun. A bystander shot video of the two fighting over the axe. Court records say that Montgomery was able to wrestle the axe away from Calhoun and bystanders separated the two. Calhoun wanted his axe back. He didn't get it, but he got back in his vehicle and took off. I refused to give him that axe back. You know, I already took a couple wax already. So I took the axe and uh, placed it in my tr the trunk of my car. The bystander video showed a handyman sign on Calhoun's car that helped identify him. You have to be careful out here in these streets driving, you know, you have to, you know, you got a lot of crazies out there, you know, that do things like what just happened to me uh, on the 11th. Calhoun is charged with battery and intimidation. Calhoun is also awaiting trial on another battery charge from an August incident. In Indianapolis, Rich Nye, 13 News. Road rage has been a growing problem across central Indiana. And we've talked to experts about avoiding the dangers of road rage, and you can find their advice, which sometimes includes not using your car horn. That's listed at WTHR.com.